Along with many other museums in St. Petersburg, the Russian Museum can be added to a city tour customised by Express to Russia. The Russian Museum is the largest collection of Russian fine art, hosting more than 400,000 works of art. The collection runs in chronological order from the 11th century up to the 21st century. The first few rooms are a selection of religious icons. The museum hosts all different types of art. In just a few rooms, you can see iron busts, tapestry, bronze statues, marble statues. This is the White Hall and is the only interior space in the palace which is unaltered from its original decor. This incredible canvas is the last day of Pompeii. The Wanderers were a group of artists who turned their backs on the institution's confinements. They are well represented in the Russian Museum. This is one of the most famous Russian works of art by Nicholas Gay. Ilya Repin is often considered Russia's most famous artist and here are two of his works. The museum was opened in 1898 in Mikhailovsky Palace to house the collection of art of Emperor Alexander III. This is a famous bronze statue of Ivan the Terrible. There is a wide variety of folk art in the Russian Museum, which is slightly out of the way of the natural flow of the exhibition, but is most definitely worth a look. This passageway shows the development of the museum through the years. This is a piece of work by Mikhail Brubel, who was an integral artist in the movement of the early 20th century. In the years leading up to the revolution, new styles exploded onto the Russian art scene, cubism, Futurism, Suprematism and Constructivism. All the remaining works are from the Soviet period and although were highly censored, they reveal interesting insights into life during this time. The Russian Museum is an encyclopedia of every era of Russian art. If you are an art lover, then this is not to be missed. For more information on St. Petersburg and Russian tours, please visit the Express to Russia website.